Hi guys, my name is Fiona James Cullen and welcome to episode 5 of Sims for a Black Widow Challenge. Imogen is fast asleep where we left her last episode and Sergio is, poor unsuspecting Sergio is, I don't know, just on his phone in the bathroom. I said at the end of the last episode I would have a little kind of mess around with the house and I have done a little bit. Somehow I think I've ended up with more money than I had. I think it was probably because I've gotten rid of like the walls in between like this uh, hallway here and the lounge and a couple of other walls. So maybe that's where, where I've got the money from and I've just put a door from this used to be a little bedroom, a single bedroom, and there was a wall here between them, and I've just taken down that wall, changed the kitchen around slightly, and so we now have a dining room, because today's episode, we need to have a dinner party. Sergio and Imogen have just got married, and we need to have a dinner party to show off that Imogen is the perfect wife, and then we're going to basically find a new fella and kill off Sergio, is kind of the plan. <laughs> I don't know how far we'll get in this episode, whether... We will get to uh, get to try and start killing Sergio off, or what? What will happen? But let's go ahead and have a dinner party. So we want to plan a social event, right? So we're going to have a dinner party, and I don't know whether I should invite. Mm, hang on, let me have a little think. So the hosts are Imogen and Sergio, and we kind of, I don't know whether I should invite the guys that we've been flirting with or like, should I invite Don? Could be dangerous because at the dinner party we don't, we want to be sort of perceived as this, this kind of nice, nice new couple. So let's not maybe invite Don. We could maybe invite some of the others uh, that we've kind of flirted with a little bit. We must invite a girl. What about, I know, let's invite Dominic. Who's Dominic married to? Is it Moira? I can never remember. Oh, is Moira her, his kid? How many people? Hang on. We've only got seats for for six of us. Although I think that doesn't really matter. Should we invite Mortimer? Is it, um, okay, hang on. I'm going to invite... Is that all blokes that I've invited? No, we've invited... Hang on. That is who I'm going to invite. There we go. And we need a caterer. We'll have... Who should we have? Clara? Let's invite Clara to be the caterer. And let's go. So this is just the yeah, Kaminsky residence. We need to get a... Oh, Don. Congratulations on getting married to Sergio. I hope the two of you are very happy together. Hmm, Don. Really? Because... Oh, look at them. I don't know why I'm saying R oh, because it's so not R. Oh. He looks nice, doesn't he, in his, uh, his little pink pink jacket there. Right, do we need a bar? I feel like we have to have a bar for a dinner party. And a stereo. Right, I didn't plan this. Right, let me go and get a a bar and a stereo. Um, just a little thing, a kaboom box we'll get for now. And there. And a... Bar. Do we need a bar? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we do need a bar. Portable bar? What is a portable bar? With lights and everything. That's nice. Let's have that there. I don't know if we need it. I think we do. Like, I don't think we can make drinks any other way, can we? Or can we make drinks from the... Hmm. No. Let's make drinks at the bar. Make... Right, hang on, let's practice making drinks, make drinks. Should we just tend the bar? Am I doing this completely wrong? I feel like I'm doing this completely wrong. We need three sims dancing at the same time. Hopefully that won't be too hard. Is anybody gonna... Does people want a drink? Anyone? Yes, everybody wants a drink. Come on then. We need to make three drinks. And then I think with... We'll come and thank... Thank for coming. Ooh, look at Imogen. Shaking. Making a few cocktails out there. Let's make a drink. Make a drink for... 
Let's make one for Rene. I'm going to make drink, make drink four, we'll make one for Dominic as well, make one for all the blokes. Sergio might start thinking, hang on a second. Oh my goodness, there's no time left. This is an epic failure of a, of a meal. Hang on, let's call to meal if you want. Call to meal. This is a complete failure. How did how did time go so fast? No! 57. Hang on, I just said there was 11 minutes. Call to meal. Go, go, and... What a failure this is. Call to meal. Oh, there we go. Dawn, we've called to meal. Imogen, go to the toilet, love. We still need to make drinks. This is just food everywhere. We've got we've got a silver, so that is we needed just at least a silver in this dinner party. So that's okay. That is not too bad. So we are now. Who are we with here, Rene? So let's let's like chat, kiss hand. Oh my goodness, that is that's too much. I think we're going to go with, we're just sort of lining people up with Imogen, Will, I think Don, Don Lothario is going to be kind of the next, oh, what, everybody's got something different, <laughs> fish and chips, a grilled cheese and BLT, okay, fair enough, <laughs> way to please everyone at a dinner party, make completely separate meals for everyone. Five minutes left. Okay, well, I think I was going to go and try and do the music one, but there is not particularly much point in trying to do the music one. It keeps going up. I don't understand. Why does the time keep changing? Right, let's try and get everyone dancing then. You turn it on. Right, you stop eating. Might as well try and finish the gold then. If. Uh, if we've got the time to do it, although I'm not I'm not sure what's happening with the time. It just keeps changing. Right, let's go and see if everybody wants to come and dance. Turn this on. Turn on pop. And then everyone everyone dance. Come on everyone. Gosh, no look now time's about to go. One hour fifty two. There we go, that works. Is he gonna dance? Is he gonna dance? Dance with us. Is it an option anywhere? Oh, invite Bowen to dance. There we go. Come on, dance with us. Yes, there we go. All right, let's go make a few drinks now. Make a drink for Imogen. We're gonna get. Uh, Sergio, I completely forgot his name then. Get Sergio to make a drink for Imogen while she's uh, cozying on up to Bowen over here, dancing with him. Have some to come play for at the same time. That is one that I can never, ever do. Right, and then we'll make drink, make drink for uh, Moira. Go on, where are you going? I don't think he's happy about the situation going on here with his wife. Oh no. Oh he's poorly. Oh no. He's not well. Um open No no no, don't open it. Don't open. Have Have some orange juice. That will that will help you, maybe. But then when you've done that, please come back outside and make a drink. Make a drink for Moira. Uncomfortable. There's food everywhere. Look, she's just been getting like all the vegetables out of the fridge and then just leaving them lying around all over the place. Very angry from an awkward encounter. Why? Is she just... Because <laughs> she's knocked over the bin. Why is she knocked over the bin? Pick it up. 
She's not coming again anyway. She's definitely not invited back to a dinner party. Oh, here we go. Dinner party complete. Great dinner party. There is a decorative pot rack for your household infantry. Nice. There's no point in making a drink now. I'll oh, see you soon. Bye, everyone. So we've shown off that we are... Look at all this food. We've shown off that we are a lovely, happy couple together. Now it's time. To be Imogen's evil self. She's going to wreak havoc so I think let me just try and tidy up put all this stuff away and I am wondering whether we should possibly get try for a baby with Sergio I think I've spoken about it before and somebody was mentioned that you are supposed to do that I think depending upon which set of rules you read that they've been sort of slightly adapted I don't know which was the original sort of versions or whatever but depending upon the ones you read depending upon how sort of the rules go and the ones that I read don't say that um, that you do have to have a child with everyone, but you get more points if for each child that has like a different dad. So maybe I kind of didn't want Imogen to have children because I think it's quite hard to like maybe go out and meet new meet new guys and whatever if she's got new children. But should we try and get try and like try for a baby with Sergio before we kind of start? I think I'm gonna because like, if you get more points for having more babies with different different men, so that's what we're gonna do. I think. So after we've all tidied up and everything, let's try for a baby. I hope you guys don't mind that decision. I don't know whether you would prefer that she didn't have children or whatever, but I'm gonna go gonna go with that. Let me know what you do think about that as a general sort of thing moving forward. Whether we should try try for a new sort of new baby with uh, with each each new husband that we get. All right, let's uh, we're gonna do this woohoo. Let's turn this off. Turn it off. Is he better now, or I think he's? I think he might be feeling better. Don't sleep. Don't be sleeping, dude. Try for a baby with Imogen. I I may never do this. I can't, I kind of don't really want to do this, but I don't know. I'm gonna you get more points for doing it, so I'm gonna gonna go with it. And. Then I don't know whether she's going to be like a good mother or is she going to be just like one of those mums that is just out all the time meeting new men. Well, obviously she's going to be out all the time meeting new men, but I don't know. Just have to sort of see, see how it goes. We we'll have to uh, we'll have to get our new guy in first off. Right, she can she can get up now. It's like three o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs> Wake up, girl. He'll be home from work before. What time is it? Uh, seven o'clock. He is back. So. Okay. That's alright. Finish eating that and then invite. Let's. In, should we just invite him around here? Let's invite. That's kind of risky, isn't it? We'll invite Don around here. And then maybe go out on a date with him just before Sergio gets home from work if sort of she hurries up. <laughs> the whole time and things. She's she's a. Uh... Oh, Imogen is not pregnant. Okay. I don't think I've ever had that before. I've never taken a test and they've not been pregnant. Right, Donald Fario will be right over. Okay. We have got just under two hours. Change outfit into. What is her? Hang on, hang on. I really want to. I was gonna put on like some sexy lingerie or something. That means she can answer it the door like that. Okay. <laughs> um. Let's see. Heartfelt compliment. Like maybe go inside. No, I don't like that outfit. I really want to change it. <laughs> right. Should we just let's just go flirty all the way. Poor thing. Let's let's just be friendly to him for a little bit. Ask to move in. Ah. Um, let's just sort of be nice to him first off, and then we will go for it. Let's confess our attraction to him. I probably should go on a date. What time is it? We just need to be careful on the time. It's quarter past six. Husband might be home at any time. Let's pick up line. Let's first kiss. Let's risk it. Ooh. 
right, let's ask him now if he wants to go out on a date before... Before he could... Woohoo in a bush? Should we woohoo in a bush? No. Let's... Quickly ask him about his love life and then let's date. No, it's... Look, hang on. We've got like seven minutes before he's home. This is getting... We need to like go somewhere. How do we... Ask on a date. There we go. Wait, stop this chatting. Ask on a date. We need to leave and we need to leave right now. Oh no, she's ill, she's ill. Don't get ill. Uh oh, he's home. <gasps> Should we allow him to catch us? Maybe? I know, right, where is he? Where is he? There he is. I feel awful on Sergio. I wish we could like control Don and like get him to hide somewhere and stuff. Let's um She's feeling ill, so she needs just to In fact, do you know what? We don't need to hide it anymore because we've done our date and we've got our silver. He can just walk in on us. And that's okay. Isn't it? I think let me know like if I'm doing this right or not, guys. Can he not see why look, he is just in the shower. They are risking it there. Really, really risking it. Try for a baby. No. Kiss him. Ask to be boyfriend? No! Confess attraction. Is he not getting mad? I'm not going to sort of control him. I'm just going to see what happens. Whether just off of his own back, like, he would come out and be livid with the whole situation. Surely he should be. Now he is very angry. Flirty spouse. Sergio's spouse was flirting with another. Have they been doing this behind his back? There we go. Now he's annoyed. Should we see if he wants to be boyfriend? Let's ask him to be our boyfriend. See what he thinks. Yes, are going to be boyfriend? We have... Don just became the boyfriend of Imogen. We now have a husband. And we have a boyfriend. She's not very well, I don't think. Nice. Now we have to, um, kill off Sergio. How do we kill him off? Just by, I have no idea how to do this. I'm going to have to kind of look into, it's not something that I do in The Sims, is kill off my Sims. <laughs> She's just like, yeah, uh, whatever, I'm just going to get my phone out. Oh no, she she is ill, look. So, so right. They're just arguing, arguing about her and she's just, whatever. Um, let's rant and rave at him. How dare you? Come into my house. <laughs> Flirt with my wife. She's just feeling flirty. She needs to get some orange juice or something. Um, have some orange juice. He is mad. You can, you... Chew, chew out? Would that say chew? Throw a drink at him. Can and then let's Imogen go and like be bothered. <gasps> be bothered about him. Let's try to calm him down. It's all right. Don't worry about it. It was just a one-time thing. <laughs> oh no. Calm him down. Send him to bed. Go and sleep. Sergio, oh my goodness! They're having their first fight. Whoa! This is, should we, can we try and break it up? Break it up, boys! We can't break it up. They're just fighting. They're just, who won? <laughs> Don and Sergio now despise each other. Oh my goodness, how is our relationship? Let's just Okay, let's let's go and kiss him. See if he's all right. Dude, it's all right. Don't worry. And we are gonna get rid of the husband. 
right i need to create that he feels better now he feels all better excellent right let's say goodbye to him can we ask him to leave us to leave i feel like that's a bit rude us to leave bye I, I, is that like a rude thing? I don't mean to be rude. I'm just sort of saying, yeah, okay. Let's go and see if Sergio is all right. He is fast asleep. Um, can we talk to him? Can he get up? Is he too tired or can he get up? He can get up. Poor thing. I feel awful doing all this. Let's go and hug him. And let's try for a baby in a bush. It's okay. See, look, Imogene can just get away with it. We're just going to try for a baby. And then I need to sort of create a plan. Oh, have we not got a bush? Oh, no, he's ill. Try for a baby. Let's just try for a baby with him. Right, they're trying for a baby. But I, I don't really know like how I can kill Sims. It's not something that I've ever really done. I know I can like drown them or like fire. But let me know down in the comments ways of killing Sims so that I can kill off Sergio and marry Don. Because that's all going well. He's now our boyfriend. It's been a good episode, right, guys? Thank you so much for watching this video. Go ahead and thumbs up if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. I will see you guys soon for a new video. Thanks for watching. Bye.